Maggio. And Mimi, you attended Amy's speech today for the Women's Federation of World Peace. And what what was some of your takeaways from the, the speech today? How did you feel when you when she finished speaking? Uh, actually, in the middle of a speech, I, I couldn't help it break down and crying. And I was very inspired. And I was encouraged by her actually uh, sharing her life story that nobody could come out, break out easily and mm -hmm. share with the public and encourage they have the passion she had for the life. But most of all, I saw that God has blessed her and kept her alive to do something that for our society and community that she is sharing with. She's a strong woman, a strong mother, and strong citizen that will go forward would encourage others and truly share with her experience and what she, God had given her talent to share with a um, lot of women in this world yes. that kind of fugitive and has, whatever the reason, they have such a low self-esteem, mm -hmm. they're not coming out of the wood. And yeah. I think it could be truly inspired with Amy's life story that it's easy to understand because she is sharing her heart with it sincerely yes. and who she is and how does she come become who she is right now yes. and I was so inspired and I it is great to get to know her that yes. as a person yes as a human being right. as a woman and a mother and I'm so glad I took my time and truly came over here today and listened to her story and thank you for inviting me oh we're so glad that you came there you have it so that's a one testimonial for Amy Kardashian today at the Women's Federation of World Peace